fight. I love to compete. I love to put myself out in the lights and just to test myself. Every time the greats show up and be great is a reflection on their preparation. I'm training since 1998 and it's all about consistency. It's all about putting in the hard work. It's not just about muscles, it's about here. He believes he is the mentally strongest fighter on the entire roster. And... When I came into the karate combat, they already in my first fight gave me the best guy on the roster. He is one of the best karate combat fighters right now. I became a champion by knocking out Rocha. The champ won. The champ hasn't lost yet here at Karate Combat. Then every time after the fight, says, ah, that was like 30 or 40%. To all the people who don't like me saying that I'm fighting on 20%, just step into the pit and make me fight 100%. Oh! The lightweight division here, Bash, should be very, very afraid. Being champion is not just about raising your arm, it's about being a good human being. Mr. Edgar Scrivis, 3-0, undefeated here. I came as a challenger. My mindset was to attack, attack, and again, attack. Alhamdulillah. Scrivis actually moved this entire camp to TK MMA in Dubai. It's fight business. Anything can happen because all of these guys that are fighting in karate combat, they are the top of the top fighters in the world. Some of us are just made like warriors. I am the official challenger to the belt because I have more victories than many fighters of the division. Louis only lost against Edgar Squires for the title shot. Squivers faces off Rocha. He's just the next man in the line. That guys have the same game plan as always. Come in your face and just throw barrages of punches and even maybe a freaking crazy wheelhouse kick. It's one thing to watch my fights. It's a different feeling when the bear slayer is coming forward and putting the pressure.